The introduction of the sporty Model A Ford in 1928 created a new status symbol. The car had made headlines and brought with it such demand that it was the fortunate citizen who had the right kind of luck to buy one of the early deliveries. Even wealthy celebrities, from politicians to movie stars, wanted to be associated with the dandy Model A and pulled strings to get one. Cowboy humorist Will Rogers ordered a practical two-door sedan from his friend Henry Ford and in typical fashion wrote in his news column, well, after all the suspense, the new Ford's out. You want to know what's different? They changed the radiator. It was a good joke, but behind the wheel with a snappy four-cylinder engine under the hood, a handy gear shift lever and modern foot-operated brake and clutch pedals, here was a man who might have added, but I've never owned a Model A I didn't like. Meanwhile, the Ford publicity camera went to the nation's capital to get some political opinions. Here we have Senators Hale and Cousins. James Cousins went into politics after making a fortune as one of Henry Ford's original partners in Ford Motor Company. Cousins' new sport coupe on the right was a gift from Mr. Ford and was the first Model A delivered in Washington, D.C., serial number 35. 